Hi guys, good morning and welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, great big hello to you. Thanks for joining us. Today we've got something a little bit different. My name's Jean-Paul and this is the Seated Gun. I can hear them. Yeah. Well, I can't see the bastards, but I can hear them. Guys, whatever happens, you have to come to you have to come to the console valley just to meet skins. <laughs> it's an experience. <laughs> Hi guys, so today we have got something a little bit special. Uh, we are not in Wales. It's raining, but we're not in Wales. Where we are, we're in Stoke-on-Trent. Wait, wait, I know what you're gonna say. Stoke-on-Trent, what the bloody hell are you doing there? It's hardly the mecca of shooting. Guys, we have got a hidden gem, and it is something very special. Uh, we are at the wonderful, the stunningly beautiful Consul Valley. Guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel. If you want to see what we're doing on a daily basis as well, also make sure to follow us on our Instagram, where you'll see all of our daily posts, shenanigans, and everything else that we're doing as well. Guys, we're gonna bring you something very special today. Whoever you want to your pegs, you'll be live on pegs. There'll be a whistle to end the drive. Uh, no ground gain. Just actually not to shoot the woodcock, okay. If you see a woodcock, let it go for me. We don't get many. Okay then. <coughs> we'll sort the cartridges out, leave your cartridges in the peg. If you've got a loader and you want to pick them up, we'll uh, chuck the beer bag on the gun bus, okay. We'll sort them. It's numbered on your card, we'll just move up. We're only shooting seven, move up two. I'll place everyone out there, okay, then until we're sorted. Lovely job. On the gun, but send if you want. If anyone's following through, just follow through. Yeah, super job. Okay. Nice. Red Bull behind me. Yeah, they start coming as all the COVID's going out. Yeah. There we go. He was dropping faster than he was climbing. Dave took one and then I took one at the side of that. Oh, JP. I waited too long, I should have let my gun down. That's the problem. When you can see them from so far away, you, you, you try too hard, don't you? Think about it too much. Down anyway, I 
ันHi guys, so we've just done drive one. Uh, Riffits here at Consul Valley. Um, pretty good actually. Uh, we had a few good birds, missed a few good birds as well. First drive though, so we're warming up. Um, it's a lovely stone track that we're sat on, um, compounded so it's nice and firm, which is great. Driving the birds from some woods that are probably about 50 or 80 meters out and then over the top of some fir trees birds are dropping quite quickly not a lot of wind here today but uh, great first drive and nice to uh, warm up rather than being thrown in at the deep end more to come guys There, yeah. And from here, yeah. From here, right the way up, it's like nearly over 900 yards long. Bloody hell.
Hi guys, so we've just done drive two here at the Consul Valley. Um, I have to say, probably one of the most challenging drives I've done all season. Um, we are in a field at the bottom of a hill, so the field is going up onto a, quite a steep hill. We've got 25, 30 metre trees to the left of us, and they're bringing the birds in from about 900 metres worth of cover crop behind. And the drive was a really long, stretched out drive, which was really nice. So there was some really quick flurries of birds, then it went quiet, then there was the odd one. Then again, some more, which is quite off-putting. Um, but yeah, we're quite low here, so we're having to look through the branches, and the branches are still quite thick um, to see the birds. But when we did see them, we took them, which is what it's all about. We missed a fair few as well, but what a great drive. Really, really great drive. Oh, sorry. That's I right. forgot we had a double gun in today. <laughs> so, so much nicer without the rain, isn't it? They're nipping across that bank, aren't they? Bit of wind. Should get them up a little bit. See your birds coming out there. There's a few. How oh, is it? Guys, hi, drive three. Uh, skin, what's it called? Shardlows. Shardlows, he's lying to me there. I'm sure it's actually called The Ponds by Skin because he dug these ponds. But anyway, um, we're on hard standing, overlooking the railway line just in front of us. And they're bringing them off of a hill just in front of that, probably about 30, 40 meters. So not high birds. Um, a little bit quiet on this drive, but we had some really nice left crosses. We had a couple of nice over the head, over the top birds. All in all, a uh, really nice little drive. On to drive four.
there's some good height off the top of there, Skin. Shocked me a little bit, actually. Another great bird there. It's a bit of Sam. And to be able to turn and still keep the height, because normally once partridge start turning, they drop like a rock, don't they? I was going to say the pheasants will be good off here, won't they? See if we can land some in the water. <laughs> no, Skin said he's got he's got his swimming trunks in the back. I'm gonna swim across there. I'm not gonna hold He said he, he said he's got his butt. Right, that's it. That's uh, you, you're going in there, boy. You're going in there. That's recorded as well. Everyone's heard you say that. You better get your budget smugglers out. <laughs> I'll get a towel. Don't panic. Can I put a bikini on? <laughs> My God. Come on. No, they're going in that river. They're going in that water now. I'm desperate to put one in this pond. <laughs> Where's that pheasant that landed over there? Yeah. Where, where is it? Where is it? Seriously, where is it? Because when one comes up, we'll we'll have a couple of shots and we'll throw it in there. <laughs> <laughs> He'll be sorry he said that. <laughs> See, it's when that one actually was there, I did actually hear him go. <gasps> oh. Wow. Ah. Does that mean you're in the water? Yeah. No, does it bollocks? <laughs> <laughs> I'm definitely not playing this game. <laughs> yeah. Hi guys, so we've just finished drive four here at Consul Valley called The Lodges. What an amazing finish to the day. Um, we are sat just below where the lodges are above us. We've got beautiful sort of ponds and streams and lakes and bits and bobs in front of us. It's just a beautifully idyllic place to be on your last drive. The birds have been brought up over some trees the other side of the lodges. We had some great shooting. We took some great birds. And fortunately, we didn't manage to put one in the water, which meant Skin has got away without getting in there in his budgie smugglers. So next season, he's going in. He's going in. I'm telling you guys, he's going in. And we'll get it all on camera for you. I'm not sure if we'll need a PG or a rated 18 for that, but we'll keep you guys posted. Guys, we hope you've enjoyed today. We hope you've enjoyed following us. Please do make sure you share, like, and subscribe for more content. Guys, make sure you follow us on our Insta as well, which keeps you posted with all of our daily activities and all of our shenanigans. If you didn't see our last video as well, guys, then do click somewhere around there and watch that, um, because that is a hell of a video at the Brigands. Guys, once again, Thanks for your time. It's the last shoot of 2021 for us. Um, we are back in a couple of weeks' time, and guess where we are, guys? We're back in Wales. So, guys, stay tuned. Keep watching. Keep subscribing. We do appreciate all your comments. Thanks very much. We're going to see you really soon. Take care. You're getting good at that.